it's amazing what a couple of days makes. Wow. This is looking from the top of the steps down upon our little backyard garden. And there is so much going on. We have been enjoying a lot of salad out of this flower box. It's my salad flower box. You can see down there is daylilies and feverfew. And down there some beautiful flowers. Let's go take a look. A lot of activity in our neighborhood. People are celebrating the 4th of July weekend. They're with their children, their grandchildren. There's lots of activity. People celebrating and enjoying their family, which is lovely. Very nice. This is pretty magnificent right here. These opened up in the last few days. They're trumpet lilies, and they look an awful lot like Easter lilies, don't they? But they are magnificent. Wish you could smell them. They are really something else. The whole yard is filled with the smell of these beautiful trumpet lilies. And I'm taking a video later in the day. It's after, after 8 to 7.30, and the light, I think, is perfect. The colors are just dramatic and pure, and I'm out here doing some things, and I looked at the flowers and said, oh, let's do a video. Let's really take a look at things and how beautiful they are. I know these are common daylilies, but you know I really love them, and they remind me so much of my mother. So I don't really mind, they do proliferate. They, um, if I let them, they'll take over this whole area of the yard, but I'm gonna have to keep a watch on them. Oh, Buddy's out. Hello, Buddy. How you doing? Wanna say hello to everybody? Buddy. Oh, he's busy, he's busy smelling stuff, which is fine. There's St. Francis who I so love, especially his poem, Make Me a Channel of Your Peace. Um, I did some real work here this weekend, got all the weeds and everything out there in the back. I have some things that are supposed to come up, and some things are just starting. If you look right there in the middle of the picture, you'll see a little bit of green. That is a big, huge um, tuber that's supposed to send up this huge bunch of leaves. I don't know whether it's going to do that or not, but we'll see. Of course, the herbs are looking wonderful. I've been picking herbs a lot, uh, drying them in trays for teas. I cut back a lot of the herbs this early today, and we're enjoying a lot of wonderful fresh teas.
There's some wormwood in the foreground, wonderful artemisia, wonderful silver foliage. You can see the little spots of color in the backyard garden, which is going to be a lot more because the lilies are going to really start to show soon. And there's Buddy again. I think we'll end right here with Buddy. Hey, Bud. Buddy is a really good hunter. We don't have many rodents or any other critters in this yard. Right, Bud? Hey, let's look at the camera and say hello. He's a little shy. All right. Thank you for watching. Have a wonderful weekend. And Buddy says hello and goodbye. Right, Bud? Buddy. Buddy, let's go. Let's look. Look. Oh, well, he's not going to cooperate. <laughs> Have a great weekend.